Well, I was invited to be part of the program um, and to have a coach. And so I joined the program, I think in the fall. And so every month my coach calls and we chat for an hour. And um, I set the agenda and unfortunately he takes notes. And so he refers back to, and last time we talked about, and, and so it's just been a wonderful experience for me. The experience, I mean, it, it was, you, we became like friends, you know. So as she got to know me and, but it wasn't like something that she would ask, you know, that are easy questions. Um, as time progressed, it got, she was asking the difficult questions. The tough questions, you know, for me was, there was a point where I was kind of choosing between being a father and being a youth minister. And so she asked me, uh, one of the tough questions was, would you be able to do this? Um, you know, balance both being a father and being in the ministry. And it was a difficult question, you know, because I was able to find ways to balance them both. I think one of the biggest benefits to my ministry through this initiative has been really focusing in and honing the, asking the right questions. Um, and those questions help me dive deeper into what's really going on in the church and in my particular context. They help me not just kind of skim through the surface. And when I get to something that maybe needs more attention or some sort of change, it helps me not seek quick fixes, but really to ask those deep probing questions. And um, Edlin's guidance and coaching has helped me to hone those questions, but also has given me the courage and the confidence to find the resources I need to address them um, and to really continue to dig deep into them to make some lasting change.